So before we get to actually rendering the model, which can take some time to do, let's look at the possibility of just using display styles to create some interesting presentation views, especially now that we have lighting set up on the views. For instance, I could just set the display style to illustration with shadows in order to create a nice color drawing of the model. But Open Buildings also delivers several presentation display styles, such as presentation blue line with shadows, presentation blueprint with shadows, full color with shadows, and sepia with shadows. And one I really like is monochrome with shadows. Notice that the shadows are rather dark and the buildings are all sort of a gray tone. But by simply brightening the display brightness, I can lighten everything up so that I have white buildings against a blue sky. And with a little adjustment to the date and time of day, I can make the shadows a little more subtle. Now, don't just take a screenshot for a presentation. Instead, save the image with a higher resolution. On the Visualization View tab, there is a Save Image icon. So I can save the view as a JPEG or other common uh, image file types. I'm going to set the anti-aliasing quality to high and increase the pixels for a higher resolution image. Of course, you can also create your own custom display styles. I created one here for the project. I'm going to reduce the brightness back down. Note that the global brightness slider on the view is the same as the display brightness in the Light Manager. This display style is basically a copy of the illustration with shadows display style except that I added an element override to put a 15% transparency on everything. I was hoping to get more of a watercolor look. I could also add a background color. Or even an image like the sky cylinder. I have also used this as the reflection map for the glass. And again, if I save that as an image, I can get a nice image of the model. In some cases, this may work as well as a rendered view. And finally, I also wanted to show that display styles and shadows can also be used on 2D drawings. I'm switching over to an elevation drawing. In the Set Presentation dialog, you will need to have a display style that uses shadows, such as Smooth Shadows. Then you can change the forward display to one of the presentation styles with shadow. Now, you will have to modify the display styles to make them visible for clip volumes. And there is a config that has to be changed to make shadows visible on drawings. So be sure to watch the more in-depth video on shadows on drawings. Let's try the custom project display style I created. So the shadows are based on the active light setup in the model, and they do really help the drawing pop a little, especially for presentation.
If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.